A giant, mysterious object has been discovered on Daytona Beach shores in Volusia County, Florida, leaving locals and officials perplexed. The unknown object, which is composed of wood and possibly some metal, is about 80 feet, 24.3 meters, long, and was first noticed by passing beachgoers, New York Times reported. Due to the fact that water covers it during high tide, it could not be roped off. Volusia County Beach Safety said the object was visible in part because of beach erosion caused by Hurricane Nicole, which ripped through Florida last month, and by Hurricane Ian, which hit the state in September and was one of the most powerful storms to strike the United States in the past decade. Continued high tides and rough surf also played a role in the object's discovery, just south of Daytona Beach. The object appears to be made of wood and metal and to be about 80 feet long, officials said. It could not be roped off because water submerges it during high tide. The state underwater archaeological team has been notified to investigate further, said Kevin Captain, a spokesman for the Volusia County government. Theories about the object have circulated on social media and on local news websites. The guesses include that it is a barrier, a shipwreck, a portion of an old pier, or spectator seating from when NASCAR had races on the beach. It is a mystery. Many people think it is an old ship of some sort, Tamara Malfurs, a spokeswoman for Volusia County Beach Safety. The erosion on the beach has been unprecedented, we haven't seen this kind of erosion in a very long time, she said. I've been on the beach probably 25 years and that's the first time I've seen it exposed. An underwater archaeological team from the state of Florida has been notified and will review pictures from the scene. Every now and then, something pops up, and usually, you can tell what it is, Ms. Malfurs said. This one, you just can't confirm. Extreme, climate change-driven weather patterns have unearthed a number of unusual objects across the world this year. In 2020, a couple walking along Crescent Beach noticed some wooden timbers and bolts protruding from the sand. Maritime archaeologists believe it was a relic of the Caroline Eddy, a 19th-century ship. In 2021, a high school student recovered a rare 1715 fleet gold coin south of Turtle Trail Beach, off Florida's east coast. In October, a man dug up a diamond ring worth about $40,000 on a beach in St. Augustine. While it is unclear what the object may be, Florida's coasts and shorelines have turned up surprises old and new in recent years, unearthed by the sweep of shifting sands from storms, erosion and tides.